Welcome to another What I Ate Wednesday. This Wednesday morning, I'm going to have one of these Cliff Bars. These are the Cliff Crunch Granola Bars, white chocolate macadamia nut. And in the package, it's a lot like a, um, a Nature Valley that I like the, the peanut bars because these are crunchy like those. And in this package, you get two thin bars just like you do with the Nature Valley bars. And these are only 10 more calories. The Nature Valley are 190. These are 200, but they're really good bars. So that's how I'm starting off my day. Well, I just came in the kitchen to get myself some lunch and <laughs> I just realized that I did not, uh, I don't have any peanut butter crackers like I normally eat. I just uh, forgot to pick some up this weekend, but that's okay, I don't mind. I could eat something else. There's plenty of stuff to eat here. There's soup, there's sandwiches, there's frozen meals, all kinds of stuff, but this is what I'm gonna eat. Uh, I know, I'm bar crazy. That's all I've been wanting lately. I've just I just crave them. I just really, really, really enjoy them. Uh, this is the Nature Valley Crunchy Peanut Butter Bar. I did not have one for breakfast, so I'm gonna have it for lunch. <laughs> and I have my Coke Zero, that's what I'm gonna drink. So I forgot to tell you earlier that um, the the bar for breakfast was 100, no, the bar for breakfast was 200 calories. That counted totally. But then the bar for lunch was 190 calories. I got on the elliptical, worked off 90 calories, so it was only really 100 calories. So now I'm gonna have one of these Fiber One bars. This is 90 calories, but it won't count because I've already gotten on the elliptical and worked it off. And believe it or not, I still don't have my steps for the day. My goal for each day is 10,000 steps. You would think getting on the elliptical all those times and I would have plenty of steps, but um, I don't. I, I don't know. I will tell you what I'm at because this is average. This is normal for the every day. I have... Um, 8,427. So I still have like 1,600 steps to go today. So I know you all think I'm weird for getting on the elliptical and working on my calories, but it, it, it pays because I, I get my steps in. Anyway, this is a fiber one. <coughs> Sorry. This is a fiber one lemon bar. I absolutely love these. I love the little lemon pieces in them. They're awesome. 90 calories, but it won't count. Tonight for dinner, Kevin is um, Kevin is outside and he is grilling me um, and him um, a uh, piece of uh, a summer sausage link. They're 150 calories, and um, I just like that kind of thing cooked out on the grill. And so I'm going to while he's cooking that on the grill, I'm going to make his uh, what he calls he grew up. They call it toad in the hole. And notice I'm using Aunt Millie's bread because it is 35 calories. Uh, so many of the breads that we have bought um, are more than 35 calories. And it just, you know, I don't trust trust uh, them anymore. Uh, so I won't buy them anymore because they end up being like 50 calories. And to me, that's, that's not right to do that to people. To make people think it's 35 and then it's like you're cheating. So anyway, I'm going to make Kevin's Toad in the Hole recipe. This is 35 calorie bread, which really, it's not 35 calories anymore, is it? But I'm counting as 35 calories. I'm going to try to use only half a teaspoon of butter since it's just going around the edges. And so that would be 25 calories but I might end up needing the whole, um, a whole tablespoon. Actually, I get more than this because three, three teaspoons are in a tablespoon, so I can actually have more of this and it'll still only be 25 calories. So I think I should still, especially with taking the middle out of the bread, I still should only be able to count that as 25 calories. So let me turn my stove on. And so I'm gonna have an egg. The egg is, um, the egg is 70 calories. And um, so I'll fry it here and then, uh, then I'll show you how it looks at the end. So the 70, I added it up. 70 and 35, um, what's 35? Oh, 70 for the egg, 35 for the, um, 
the bread, and then another 25. It's only 130 calories for this. And then Kevin's gonna uh, make us the sausage link. So the total for the meal will be 280 calories, but I'm going to, at the end of the meal, I'm planning to eat a cookie. So the cookie is um, 80 calories. So I'll actually be eating 300 and 360 calories. This is the cookie I'm talking about. They are these, um, they're the Pepperidge Farm coconut macaroons. They are absolutely fantastic. I love them. I can get three bites out of them because they're thicker than what you think they are. Uh, but they're 80 calories each and, and I love them. So at the end of the meal, I'll be grabbing one of these just so you know. But I'm not going to put it on my plate right now with this, this like breakfast for dinner meal. So I'm going to cook this. You all have seen Kevin make this, I'm sure. So here is my dinner, and I went ahead and put the cookie on the plate anyway. I know that's a weird combination, but I'm going to eat it anyway, so I figured I might as well show it to you. This is the sausage link, and like I said, it's 150 calories. I'm sure it'll be worth every calorie, though. So this is a pretty a low-calorie meal. I think this is a good meal. Um, so anyway, that is my dinner for tonight. It is 8.15 and I want a little snack, so I'm going to get another one of these cookies that I had earlier. These are the Pepperidge Farm um, coconut, um, I just, coconut macaroons, I love them. Uh, they're 80 calories, so I'm going to add 80 more calories to my day. For my first snack, I'm going to have eight Ritz crackers and they are 16 calories each. And then I'm going to have two of these Alouette cheeses. These are the uh, garlic and herbs, and they are 40 calories each. And so that's 80. And then I'm going to have one of, another one of these cookies. I know this is the third cookie you all have seen me eat tonight. <laughs> but there's only one left in the package. So anyway, I'm going to eat that, and then I'll see you at 10. For my last snack of the night, I'm going to eat this Halo Top. This is the mint chip. It's only 240 calories. And while I wait for it to get a little soft, I'm going to eat my last uh, coconut macaroon. And you probably will never see these again because uh, I like them so much. And it's just too big of a temptation. And they're 80 calories a piece. And so, anyway, I haven't gone over calories a lot. I mean, I'm still less than 1,300 calories, even with all these cookies. But still, I don't need the temptation. So, um, I hope you've enjoyed this What I Ate Wednesday.